It, it does. We've talked uh, quite a bit about it. Starting the spring training, you, you learn what kind of teammate you are when uh, when you get taken out of a game or when you get pinch hit for and trained for. Um, obviously, all these guys are competitors and want to be able to do it uh, every chance they get. But uh, as soon as I had the conversation with Albert, he was uh, on board and then filled Gorman in on kind of what to sit on and kind of how to approach that at bat. So uh, he was equally, equally as happy for uh, for Gorman and anybody. So he's a pro, man. Gorman in his hometown was nice, but Albert, two homers, four hits overall, even tempted to steal base. Took a good <laughs> throw to get him at second base. Yeah, we, we had something on Bum, and uh, he took a chance there. But uh, overall, just an incredible night. Um, He's taking some really good swings, uh, two home runs. Uh, pretty special to watch, but uh, he's doing a really nice job right now. Probably a bit of a chicken and egg question, but who's having more fun? Is Albert having more fun with this team, or is the team having more fun because of Albert? I mean, how, is, how are you seeing this kind of feed into each other? The group's enjoying competing together. They're embracing competition, but they're having fun while they do that. And uh, it's a perfect mix of veteran guys, young guys, and at the end of the day, they're super prepared. And once they go out there, they're focused on executing and having a good time. And it's uh, it's fun to be in that dugout right now. There's a lot that goes into it. Do you have a favorite part of this game? I and mean, it seems like you can go with the grand slam to end a slump. Yeah. The bare hand play. That play was incredible on both sides, the bare hand, the pick. Mm-hmm. Um, there's not another combo that can pull that one off right there. Uh, the two home runs by Albert, oh, that's incredible. Um, it's good to see Paulie come through there with that grand slam. He's had a, a tough time in a, a stretch that's not going the way he wants it to. So to, to be able to do that was, was good. And then uh, New Park continues to swing a good bat and give us, uh, I mean, just really quality at bats there in the nine hole. Uh, he'll be leading off tomorrow against Wrighty, but. Yeah, um, there's a lot of good things. Palante being able to come in there and do what he did for two innings. And then it was nice to see Romero there at the end. That's, uh, that's electric stuff. You can use that. The response by you guys after they cut the lead and made it a ball game, it was almost an unforgiving response. I know you like to see that offensive. Yeah, you do. Uh, our guys are, are really focused on what we're capable of doing. Yeah. Just uh, There's a lot of trust up and down that lineup right now. Um, that was a pretty good display right there. Did you, uh, did you see Hudson had some moments where he was able to get out of trouble? Kind yeah, of had a few moments of trouble. Yeah, the the walks in the first inning were the tough ones to watch. Um, overall, we wish he would have given us more length, but he was intentional during the last uh, week in increasing the velo of that sinker. We saw him up to 94, which is closer to that baseline of 2019. So that was a step in the right direction. But at the end of the day, um, he didn't get your normal ground ball double play to get out of certain innings um, and the three walks made it tough. Deep counts, 3-2 counts often, leadoff man only 2 out of 5. So um, it would have been nice to get a little bit more out of him.